This is a public service announcement from Rattle Can Guitar Restorations. If you pull your glue out of the glue pot and it is cloudy, there's a really good chance when you open it up that it's just, oh my gosh, that's, <laughs> oh, it has gone bad. So, oh man. It tastes bad. <coughs> so just throw it away. <laughs> Make some more. <coughs> oh. Oh. That's bad. Oh, sh <laughs> Oh, I'm glad we. <laughs> Man. What was the bad juju? Um, so here we are. We've got this uh, new batch. Uh, just mixed it up. I don't use the instructions on the glue because it comes out so thick and soupy. It just doesn't work. Um, I use two to one. Uh, I use a scoop of glue and I use two scoops of water. I'll let this sit overnight um, till it's all absorbed up and then I'll heat it. Um, I'll heat it probably tomorrow morning and I'll just let it keep heating uh, for most of the day and then um, by the end of the day it should be should be good to go. But right now it just looks like applesauce. Maybe. So let's with fear and trepidation let us um, remove the screw from this neck. Begin. Have you ever seen one of these? I have not. There it is. <sighs> One neck heel screw. Put that with all the other parts. So now we're just going to we're just going to take a sharp uh, razor blade and uh, we're going to trim along we're going to trim along the edges there so that if we have any finish that um, should be a pair of loops right there right there. 
that big empty spot right there. There should be a pair of loops right there. It's like it's magic. There's glue squeezing out. It just kind of crumbles once you get in there. to get some steam going and maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Hey everybody, it's the next day and it's time to take the neck, jeez, time to take the neck off. So uh, we'll get the, we'll get the old espresso steamer fired up. Um, I have filled the inside of the guitar right back here. Um, with a towel to try to catch any moisture that's going to be spewing forth here. I've got a towel underneath here to catch, again, any water that's going to be spewing forth here. And the idea is to get the nozzle inside the hoel right there. And then we will uh, do some steam injecting. And then hopefully we'll get this thing get this thing off. So let me get this fired up. All right, let's have some fun.
Now normally we don't have the luxury of being able to move this around because there's, well there's a fingerboard in there. That was it. That little tiny pop that you heard, that was it. That's all she took. I am not kidding you, the easiest neck removal I have ever done and probably ever will. So while this is still all nice and liquidy goopy, you can see just how quickly this stuff has uh, uncongealed. I don't know if that's the right word or if it even is a word. Here, let's get this thing off. Man, that was record time. Don't ever expect to see that again, as long as you live, or as long as I live, however long that is. <clears throat> A little bit damaged, but that'll, that's just surface stuff, that'll dry out, that'll be fine. So don't, uh, don't fret, Adam. Big blob of glue right there, there's a crack. Sure as I'm standing here, there's a crack right there. You know what I think we're gonna do? Oh, my tip has come undone. That just sounds rude, doesn't it? Well, all right, there we are. The, uh, do it like this. The neck is off of the uh, Regal Belt 20th Century Power Guitar. So now we can get to this and it's gonna make life a little, a little easier for us to get that done. That's all I got today. Um, because now we have to go, now we have to go rewire stuff. This has got. This will have to sit for a couple of days anyways to kind of dry out and get rid of that uh, moisture in the finish there. This is actually fairly clean as well. I can't tell you how uh, amazingly happy I am that that went the way that it did. And then, oh, I don't know if, do we even point this out? I don't know if I can see it or not. Let's see. There's where the screw goes through, right there. Right back into the heel block, so. All right, next off. Next we'll be, uh, we'll be fixing and trying to get this aligned up. Mm, sticky. Uh, we'll try to get all this stuff aligned up so that we can uh, get the top back together. Uh, that's what I got. You guys have a great weekend. Cheers. Hey, if you like this episode of Rattle Can Guitar Restorations, you might want to check this video out as well. Be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, and if you'd like to help the channel grow, 
consider stepping over to our Patreon page and giving that a look. Y'all have a good weekend. Cheers.